it's coming along nicely. <laughs> and here we have the moon. She's in Gemini. And um, in the backyard. And, uh, my uh, Gemini is in Lilith. <laughs> um, third or fourth house, six, I don't know, I can't recall, but oh, it's so dark. Just a silhouette. I'll show you um, what I did this morning. Well, one thing I danced a barracuda from heart out here. That's with my feet, you know, kind of spread out, stayed in that position for the whole song, did a bunch of shaking and moving. This, this is a cinder block if you can't see it. But I danced to, I believe it was a Katy Perry song up here. Dark Horse, maybe. That's what's cool about having kids, guys, because um, you get to go through their generation with them in a, in a certain way. And, you know, I love young people. They're fascinating. They remind me so much of us. <clears throat> so why scorn any generation? We're having new experiences. We're this far along, my friends. <laughs> oh, it's so quiet. I feel like I should light my lantern. Do I have a lighter? Yes. <clears throat> One moment. So, I did some good crying, really good crying. Um, <clears throat> there's another song by Katy Perry called I'm Wide Awake. And you know, she just nails on them, nails it on so many fronts. Children are a blessing in more ways than one. They give you a much broader perspective. And even if you don't have them, you know, like, I suspect you observe them in a different way because you don't have them, right? So that's really cool. I love children. Because I like myself. <laughs> All those things in my childhood that I used to, like, recall with such a more of a cringe type of, you know, vibe. I'm like, damn, I hated that. That was cool. <clears throat> so, um, I actually made a video earlier, but I didn't have all the all my props I wanted. So, um, I was just missing the book from my tarot card, so I couldn't read that. I couldn't. It was more challenging to to read them, you know, because it's kind of new to me, and I respect uh, I respect this a lot. Um, but I was talking about. Um, dancing and how uh, you know dancing outside with the moon used to be very normal it's what we women would do when we couldn't our resting time was over we needed to get up and do some work and we connected with the, the earth and the plants and the herbs and the animals and the sun and the moon and that was dangerous you know, we couldn't make it that easy on ourselves. We needed more to understand. More to learn. <laughs> mm, the ring is you. You are the precious. You've always been the precious. And I'm like, gosh, these are not the cards I want. These are not the drones you were looking for. So yes, I talked to my, um, <clears throat> a lot of friends of mine and they don't dance. I go, you dance? And they say, no, no. And you wonder why that is. You wonder why that is. It's serving them in some way, but it's not serving their vessel. <laughs> their vessel like, okay, this is a lesson we have to learn. Lock it up, lock it up. And it's just like, I am a bird trapped in the cage, in a coal mine. How? What is my song to be for you? 
to move me to get these wings. <laughs> Moving around. So if you be dancing in the morning with the moon, the sun, your exchange with the earth. What is your exchange with your home? Okay. It'll be different for each of you. And it's not, you're not going to be out dancing in the moon necessarily, although I don't know why you wouldn't. Or observing the sun. Feeling the wind on your skin. The rain on your face. Getting that golden dawn. Jackpot. Every day. And even if the sun isn't out, you know it's there. <laughs> Confirmation, baby. All right. Let's see what the tarot wants to talk about today. Let's do a general. This Aquarian. Interesting that mine is in love, isn't it? Oh, sweet. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, interesting. Well, we started off with the Ten of Pentacles. This is a great card. Financial success, beautiful family, um, joy. I mean, look at the unicorn. It's like, it's a baby unicorn at that. A baby unicorn. I mean, mm, grandkids. And then we have the reverse eight of rods. This guy has got, gosh, he's got three rods going at the same time. He's serious about this. I mean, he's got four left, so four on the ground and four in the air, almost. Four of rods reversed. Excuse me, eight of rods reversed. Miscommunication, inability to judge, or to make decisions. Interesting. Yeah, because is this which we're, this might be what we're all like wanting. Um, who doesn't? You know, even if you're, you're solo, you want some. That energy around you, right? You might not want to be there every day, but you want to have access. And this is like miscommunication, inability to judge or to make decisions. You're just like, I just can't make a decision, which, you know, is I think seriously gone. So we have the Queen of Cups, who is also reversed. Queen of Cups. Can't make a decision. Holy crap. Queen of Cups reversed. Emotions rule head. Need to gain a clear perspective. Need to stop living according to other people's desires and stop allowing others to take advantage. <laughs> yeah, because at the end of the day, who dies? You die, baby. Oh my gosh, it's the Six of Cups again. This has been coming up every reading I've had. Six of Cups reversed. Yeah, what was that? That was like, um, see, they don't stay just yet. They will. Six of Cups reversed. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm on pentacles. Yeah, you guys have to be patient with me. Stretch. Dance. Do a little, get your spine circling better. Even if you're just like, I'm doing it. That's good. I just been working on my spine. Six of cup reverse. Living in the past. Okay, that's that one. Living in the past. Leave behind past lives experiences and move toward the future. Yeah. I mean, you know, like, I feel like I'm doing that. Um, but it's, it's like, you know, Renee, there's more. <laughs> you think you're done, but there's more. I'm like, oh, thank you, spirit. Queen of Swords also reversed. Queen of Swords also reversed. Here's the snake head. Drop your shoulders. I've got my chest out. Kind of like a cobra. So heart forward. Whew. 
Cool. Yeah, baby. You know, just doing that type of stuff. I was selling bitter already. Queen of Swords reversed. Bitter woman. Bitter woman. Lack of trust or emotional peace. Oh my gosh. Bitter woman. Dude, yep. That feminine doesn't trust, man. It's like, no. <laughs> I don't get a rest. I don't have emotion. Imagine not having emotional peace. Jeez. My brothers and sisters. Let's look at the bottom of the deck. Seven of Cups. Upright, my friends. Lots of choices. Lots of choices. Seven of Cups. And is that really a bad thing? <clears throat> Let's make sure we all leave our choices open. Don't get too um, focused on anything outside of ourselves. Mm, I'm feeling kind of like, kind of sad. I'm feeling kind of sad. Seven cups, confusion, patience, see creative outlets. <laughs> Confusion, patience, see creative outlets. Dancing. You know, the thing is, like, I do a lot of things already. <laughs> and um, I'm going to put my leg out into an L. Oh, my gosh. Or if you're just sitting in the chair, just, like, lengthen your one of your legs. Because most of you probably aren't sitting on the ground. Or maybe you are. That'd be so good. If I, you just like Renee's having a video, I'm gonna sit on the ground. Oh, and just play into that vessel. Let's get that away. It just brings a smile to your face, doesn't it? It's like, it's like you're there for you. I'm there, why would I, why wouldn't I do this for myself? Why well, don't we do it before I like, play a sport or something and the rest of the time it's like I'm like pushing my leg into the ground um the rest of the time it's like don't bother me <laughs> I don't want that much electricity running through my body I can't handle the amperage is that word is that the word the rev the reverend Ooh, a reverend. A reverend is revving you up. <laughs> that wasn't a very good sound, unless it was like an air break. <laughs> Barracuda. So the other day, um, uh, I I got down a uh, Barracuda, dropped in. It was an airdrop Barracuda. I'm gonna read you some lyrics. Sell me, sell you, the porpoise said. Dive down deep to save my head. I think that you got the blues too. Sell me, sell you, the porpoise said. Dive down deep to save my head. No, that's not the right way. I think that you got the blues too. All that night and all the next swim without looking back. Made for the western pools. See the silly fools. I did not sing that right at all. If the real thing don't do the trick, no, you better make up something quick. You're gonna burn, 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 burn to the wick. Oh, Barra Barracuda. Hmm. <laughs> Exert control over your fierce predatory and wild nature and have an even balance over your mental condition, which tells you when to act and when to take refrain from acting and when to refrain from acting. Exert control over your fierce predatory and wild nature and have an even balance over your mental condition, which tells you when to act and when to take refrain I'm acting. What does that even mean? This is long. Last question. Why do you do what you do? Why do you do what you do? 
Why do I do this? Why do you do that? Isn't that a great question? It's really, are you trying to start your own motor, you know? <laughs> Not even that. It's, um, do you see that there's a current that can, that you could, uh, step into, swim into, and then you just go faster, and it's the quickening of the Aquarian energy. So I feel like today is pretty quick, pretty quick. All right, I think that's it. This is a very strange video. All right, you do what you do. Think about why you do it. If you want to, it's kind of fun. I love you all most.